in Investing 101, what the pros know about stock picking. Ali Ismali Du of MarketWatch.com shares some strategies. So you're investing in the stock market and you want to be more ambitious than the average investor. But how do the pros actually pick their stocks? Stocks need fuel, something to get them going. It could be a new product release, new leadership, or something else. But remember, just being in a hot industry like tech isn't always enough to lift every company's price. There are many ways to evaluate a company's potential, but these are the top two. First, check the price of the stock and compare it to its earnings and then to how much its earnings are expected to grow. This is called the price to earnings to growth ratio or the PEG. The PG should be at or close to one. The second is to study the company's balance sheet. A balance sheet is a financial summary that reflects the quality of a company's earnings. It can tell you how wisely a company manages its money. For example, a company's stock might be rising, but the company might be sitting on a ton of debt. Companies should post their 10Q quarterly and 10K annual reports on their websites. If they don't, you can find them through the Securities and Exchange Commission. But perhaps even more important than things to look for are the things you should avoid. Say no to companies with overpriced goods. The market probably knows that high-flying company sells a ton of a certain product, and that stock could be artificially inflated. Next, avoid hunches and overhyped headlines. Good companies aren't always the best stocks to hold and hunches are not an investing strategy. Leave impulse buys for the supermarket. Patience will serve you much better in the long term. When you see a bandwagon coming, don't jump on, just watch it go by. Sure, the next Google or Apple is out there, but it's very unlikely that you'll find it. Buy into companies that have a good history of earnings and have a good track record of smart reinvestment decisions. Check out businessfirstam.com to find out where to see our entire show. And don't forget to like, follow, and share Business First AM.